A suburban middle school student was attacked and it was caught on several cell phone cameras. It's just awful. Instead of a crowd of students stepping in to help, they watched the girl being assaulted by a boy. Tia is here with much more on what happened. Yeah, this is really an unfortunate story, Terrence and Sylvia. This disturbing student attack was recorded on several cell phone cameras inside Glenside Middle School in Glendale Heights. And we want to warn you, we did blur the video, but it is still very disturbing. The videos were shared on social media by several students, some of them using laughing emojis. But what happened last Thursday isn't a laughing matter. A student that has called Glendale Heights home for only two months has seen being put in a headlock by a male student that towers over her. He then pushes her head violently into a locker. She then falls onto the floor. Care Chicago believes the incident is bullying and bigotry because the student is from Saudi Arabia, speaks no English, and wears a hijab. So initially, when our attorneys spoke with the superintendent this morning, the superintendent claimed that this was not a bias-based incident. However, we do feel from, uh, from watching the video and from understanding how bullying plays out in schools and how many bullying cases are reported to CARE Chicago um, all the time, that we do, and the nature of the fact that we do know that the student is from Saudi Arabia. She just arrived here two months ago. She doesn't know much English. That would indicate to us that this this is a targeted attack. Well, interestingly enough, they say those bullying incidents in schools are up, but the superintendent Joseph Williams sent this to parents about the incident. The police have been involved from the moment of the attack and are currently investigating this matter. We are working with our legal counsel to ensure that the students responsible for this misconduct are held fully accountable for their actions. Now, we did reach out to the Queen B-16 school district to see what's next in this investigation so far. We haven't heard back. Of course, we'll stay on top of this story. Sylvia?